box. Sounds so weird now. Big box, big box. The Tag Team Generations Premium Collection with Charizard and Brakeson on the front and Venusaur and Snivy at the top. I'm glad to be back and we have to play a big game of catch up as I go through all the products I've missed. Santa Claus did give me this one so I owe it to him to open it. Look at this! Santa got me this Pokemon Generations box! That's something we'll open on the channel. I am also aware that the new Sword and Shield English booster box has dropped early in Asia, I think. I've got enough stuff to keep me entertained though, so I think I'm not gonna bother trying to speed up that process. I'll just wait till it releases like regular. Here is a code card from the back. One, two, three to the front. Unified Minds, was this? Psychic, energy, off. We've got some kind of older stuff here. Pikachu, Lickitung, we've got a Purloin, Silvalli as our reverse. And on the end, our first rare card is uh, Haraquinid. Another English one I need to get on is the big long cat Meowth box. In due time, my friends, in due time. We've got a whole bunch of uh, boosters to open up from this box and of course a whole ton of promos, maybe a coin. I don't know, I haven't really had a look at it. We'll dive into one of the promos after this, after we get rid of another Psychic Energy. Okay, we've got Misty and Lorelei. We've got a Zan fucking f Goose. Panita Crab Roller. Chin Chow. Ooh, there we go. A reverse of the Belalba and the Bryson Man. What the fuck is that? Uh, and then on the... Uh, Sylveon! English box equals sucks! At least we got Rocky Balboa. My name is Rocky Balboa. Alright, let's take a look at this little insert. We have this coin here. Quite interesting that it's not red or orange. It's like this skid mark dog shit brown color. It's got a shattered glass finish with Brakeson and Charizard. And speak of the devil, here they are again with this very beautiful card. This is a gorgeous card. The good old tag team. Uh, with Charizard not taking the limelight on this one, he's actually the background character. Very nice, very sparkly. This box um, can go for around $100. It is a big premium box. A lot of retailers selling it for that. You'd probably be an idiot to pick it up for 100 though. You can't even get some uh, cheaper prices on eBay. One, two, three to the front. Getting rid of the steel or metal energy. We've got a Pig Knight. Got Zangoose, Gloom, Rufflet, Oddish, Ralts, Sandy Gast, Sphiel, a little circle boy. We've got a Dupeter, Reverse, and on the very end, I am getting shafted! That's three for three, nothing! Come on! I might need to get out the big nut and make some sacrifices. I swear, if I don't get anything from this next one, I'm gonna have to sell my soul to the devil. We have a Unified Minds. Here we go. On the front, we have a code. One, two, three to the front there with a flip around. Lightning energy. We got Relicanth. Useless fish Pokemon. Blues tactics. Lampant. Drillba. Slack off. Fucking a hedge. We got a Honedge. Magnemite, which looks like Wally in the deserted afterworld. Uh, we've got a Haxorus as our reverse. And on the very end, not even a hollow! A crusty crab! Come on, Mr. Krabs. Mr. Krabs. Ah! Oh yeah, Mr. Krabs. Ah! The neighbors are probably just as confused as ever, thinking I'm screaming at the top of my lungs, crushing crabs in my upstairs room. Okay, so we had some very, very good luck last episode. Look at this sexy cactus. And we're finishing on a sexy bomb wielding down. What is happening? Number 65 of 60! So I think now I am being punished! Here is, at least we have all these fancy, beautiful promos to take a gander at. Look at this. Uh, if you know me, you know I'm a sucker for these plasticine Play-Doh model Pokemon. And this is really taking it to the next level uh, with a full art tag team card. It's the first time I've seen them reference Venusaur taking a shit in the forest. Forest dump. For 160. And you know he's just been eating a bunch of fermenting berries and sticks. This card was a super special get in the Japanese version. And in English we just get it as a shitty yeah, yeah, yeah. guaranteed box promo. Gorgeous card though. Here is a code card with the last three digits missing for the whole box online. I'll give away some more digits as the video goes on. Just to give everyone a running chance. Here is the code for this one, one, two, three, to the front, getting rid of fire energy. 
Reset stamp. That's what we need. We need a good hard reset here. I'm getting jack shit. Please. I can't be fucked like five times in a row. We've got... We need just a, just a holographic to bring it home. Are you kidding? This should be illegal. I'm returning this box. This is the worst luck I've had. Oh, all right. What do we have here? We've got, okay. One of these big play mats that you could probably double as a mouse pad. Pokemon trading card game in the corner and all your boys there. That's a very nice mat. We have a bunch of leaves. We've got a bunch of water. We've got a bunch of fire. Very cool. Very swag. I like it. Check out my sunglasses. Very cool. Very swag. I like it. All right. Two packs to go from this big $100 mega box. You've got to be shitting me if I don't get at least one holographic. It's got to be like a world record. Here we go. There is a code. One, two, three to the front. Getting rid of the darkness energy. Okay. Mashana. Don't let me down. We've got Misty's favor. We've got Noctowl. Misty, please give me a favor. Give me something on the back of your pack. Please. Cottony. Reverse. And it's... No! You are kidding me! It's even a fucking double! Lanius! Nothing! Twice! <laughs> I'm gonna take a big forest dump on the rest of this garbage. Nah, that's a cursed box. That is a cursed box. Here's another piece of the code. Now we're gonna take a look at the oversized promo in here, which is um, just the card we've already seen, but much, much bigger and more magnificent looking. Look at all the holographic components of this big sucker. Charizard and Brakeson, Sun and Moon promo 230. Now, we, we've really just gone straight through these. We have one final pack, Unified Minds. But before we open that, I think it's time for Max Mofo's Postcard Collection! It's the segment where we typically open up postcards or other weird free goodies from the Pokemon Center Online, the Japanese one, not the shitty American one. This episode, we actually have a new postcard, one we haven't seen up to date. It is celebrating all the electric rodents. Is that all of them? It's probably not all of them. Maybe it is. We got Pikachu on the back, Pokemon Center, Online, the Premier Ball stamp part, and all of our boys. And we're gonna add him right there. Right! Now, we're still getting through Christmas presents. Let's see what Santa has left us today. We have... Oh, right! Yes! Pins! The Pokemon uh, Band promo. Pins. I love pins. I've got to get a cork board and start putting up all my pins. Here is... The little Pikachu playing a guitar pin. And then we have all the boys in the band. Zorora, Pikachu, and Electivire. And lastly, before we open up the last pack, a couple more deck sleeves. I can't stop myself! Something is wrong, mentally. These ones are probably part of an art collaboration. We've got them all in this really ink looking more traditional Japanese style. We've got the three legendary dogs, and then we have their herder, the big electric sky dragon. But that's not all. Coming with these is something even more useless that I am forced to collect. We have the same artwork on some paper holders, and that is attached to the back of this. It's a two-part series. Pikachu versus Rayquaza on the other side. All right, let's open this pack. You know what? I am so sure this is part of the cursed box. I believe so much in the curse that I'm just gonna bend this one in half. Just to add that little extra bit of risk. Okay, let's see what we get here. I, I'm telling you, it's gonna be nothing. Here is the code card, one, two, three, to the front. It's been a while since I've done one of these. Oh, here we go, all right, that little, you put those in your wallet or something. We've got a Tauros, we've got a Munchlax. We've got a Magneton, we've got a Purloin, we've got a Magmar, Tynamo, Cosmog, Salandit, Finion as our reverse. On the very end, I told you! Have you ever- Okay, is it possible to get that bad luck? Let me know below in the comments, please, if you've ever opened a box that dog shit. I'm talking nothing! I can't believe that. That is such a strange set of events. Cursed! All right. Hopefully we have a little bit better luck with the Burning Shadows pack of the day where we're trying to find the Rainbow Charizard. Let's see. I can't believe that, honestly. Here is a code card. One, two, three to the front. I'm sorry I keep going on about it. That is just... 
part of me was like, obviously, it's not going to be, it can't just be, you know, nothing the entire way. But it actually was. I was thinking it was going to be at least a hollow. Here's a pan sage as a reverse. Very end. Are you seeing this? Something's happening. Someone's put a curse on me. I bet it was unlisted leaf. I'm fuming. Absolutely fuming! I am fucking fuming! Mega, mega fucking fuming! I'll see you in court, Ando. Thanks for watching, guys. Um, all right, I've got this one other thing that I was sent. I don't think I purchased this. I don't know why I would. I don't read Japanese. This came with uh, just my online normal Pokemon Center orders. It's like, I don't know, a Sword and Shield mini manga or something. Such good artwork! That is cool! I wish I, I could read Japanese. It's a journey of Ash and Lugia and Pikachu. Is this like the 2000 movie? Or Oh no, wait! I think this is the new protagonist. I don't think this is Ash. Is this weird new kid or something? Oh no, we've got Ash as well. Or maybe it's Red. I don't know. Who gives a shit?